Well, for Rookcaster, my name's John Nelson. A few weeks ago, Lynn announced their latest Climax DSM that you can see on the screen below me. The new Climax DSM features an organic DAC, Lynn's latest generation of DAC architecture. At the same time, they announced that new organic DAC was going to be available in new Climax exact boxes and new Climax 350 exact speakers. They also announced that Organic DAC was going to be available as upgrades to Exact Boxes and to Climax 350 speakers. So today we're going to be looking at the upgrade process for a Climax Exact Box. If you want to know more about Exact and what it can do for your system, check out some of our other videos or come to Ripcaster and we'll be able to show you how, what Exact can do with your system. So here we have a, a Lin Climax Exact Box. Uh, if I just it's in the usual solid build billet aluminium case. On the back, you can see it's got uh, the six uh, outputs and the digital exact links here where it feeds the signal. This one is the previous generation featuring uh, Catalyst. Let me just turn it round. You can see the uh, Catalyst logo and this upgrade is relatively straightforward. It's simply remove this base and we're going to take out the whole motherboard uh, and replace it with one with the organic DAC. The kit arrives to us from Lynn. Uh, it's specific to the individual serial number of the exact box that we're upgrading. Uh, the original motherboard that was in this unit, uh, the Catalyst one in this instance, that gets sent to be recycled. There's no, uh, it can't be reused because of serialization and the configuration that's associated with your, your speakers, etc. Okay, well, let's just have a quick look at the what comes in the kit before we actually fit it to the, to the unit. So the kit arrives to us from Lynn and it's fitted by a dealer for you. So it can be fitted in your home uh, or more generally back at, at the dealership. And this is what's actually in the, the pack. Um, you get a new logo to identify that you've got the organic DAC fitted. Uh, there's a set of uh, fixing screws for the, for the main board. There is uh, a heat sink template. There are various uh, heat sinks on the back of the, or heat absorbing pads on the back of the circuit board. And this just makes sure that they're all located in the right place. And then there's the actual board itself. So I'll just get this one out. And all that we'll be doing is swapping the existing board in the Climax Exact box for this board. So we'll, we'll be able to compare the two when we get them out. But uh, as you can see, it's got the organic and the exact logo. And again, the exact links and then the six uh, analog outputs. So this will have six organic DACs on this board. If I flip it over, you will see the uh, heat transfer pads uh, on the actual unit. And I assume that this allows me to line that up. And it tells me that one is missing, which should go there. So we'll put the motherboard on one side and we'll go back to the original unit uh, and take the old motherboard out. So the first thing we're going to do is remove these set screws and remove the base off the unit. With those all slackened off, we should be able to just lift this off like so. And here you can see the uh, Catalyst exact board. And we're basically going to replace this whole circuit board. The power supply down here remains the same, but this whole unit gets replaced. The next thing we're going to do is remove the retaining screws for each of the XLRs and the RJ45 connections. So next we'll remove the connecting cables. So this one's for the mains. So that's out of the way. Uh, we've got uh, LED for the power, the blue LED, and the main cable supplying the power supply. So again, we'll just ease that. Okay. So next, all we have to do is remove the eight motherboard returning screws. Uh, 
Okay, so with all, this, all the screws removed to the motherboard, we should be able to just lift this up and out. Uh, there is a bit of resistance, no doubt, as we do this. Okay, so it's, it's free now, and I just need to tilt it and slide it out, and there we have the original Catalyst uh, motherboard. I'll put that on one side. So here you can see uh, the bare chassis, uh, you can see the CNC marking out of the solid billet from when it was originally manufactured uh, and all that we're going to do is fit the organic board into that space and reconnect. Let's just compare the two uh, motherboards side by side. These are the two motherboards side by side and it, obviously you can see some major differences uh, on the internal components, these big transformers have all been miniaturised. Uh, and generally all the circuits and all the components have all gone down in scale, uh, partly because of Lin's uh, later generation manufacturing processes and obviously developments in, in technology. So this upgrade is, is organic DAC. It will go from both a Catalyst uh, exact box but also from the previous generation as well. So it doesn't matter what version of exact box you've got, this upgrade is equally applicable. So let's now fit the motherboard, the new organic motherboard, into the Clamex exact box chassis. Uh, so here's the new board, I've turned it upside down. I just want to make sure I've got all the heat pads in the right place, so this template helps me do that. Uh, and there's one here that I just need to sit in here and give a little bit of pressure. Okay, so we're just going to put this in, we need to angle it again. We've checked that the uh, heat pads are all in the right place. Clear the cables out of the way. and touch down. So we've put the motherboard, sat it in there. Uh, Lynn gave us a new set of uh, nine screws in this instance uh, to fit to the motherboard. So we'll just do put the screws in. So that's the motherboard secured. Uh, all we now have to do is, is now reconnect the cables. So we'll put the, the mains in there. And just dress that. Uh, the LED off the front. Again, we'll just dress that. And then the actual mains cable as it comes off the power supply. Internals done. We'll now put the retaining screws in the XLRs and the RJ45s. Okay, so we've finished securing the, the back panel connectors. We've put all the cables, they're all, all good. So all that we need to do now is just put the lid back on the bottom. Okay. We've completed upgrading the exact box. Now, the last thing we need to do is stick the organic logo on the bottom to show that the unit has been updated. Okay, so we finished upgrading the exact box to the organic DAC and we've now connected it. As you can see in the rack below me, uh, you can see we've got a Clamax DSM at the top. Uh, we've got the Clamax exact box with organic and below that we've also got a Clamax exact box with Catalyst. Uh, so if you do come to Ripcaster, you will be able to hear the difference between an exact box with organic and one with catalyst. Um, but let's just have a look at how those, how it now appears in, uh, in config. So I've now opened up uh, config. Uh, you can see we've got a couple of Climax DSMs. So I've connected it to the next generation Climax DSM here. And if we go into exact, click on exact, this will then show us the that we've got two exact boxes. Uh, if I click on the question mark here, it will show me that this is the unit using the Catalyst DAC. If I click on the question mark here, it will say, in fact, it says it's in the title, Climax Exact Box Organic, and I'll click again on the question mark. It tells me that it's running the organic firmware and that it's an organic DAC. So at this point, 
uh, this exact box is ready to configure. We would select the speakers that we want to configure and away we go. Okay, so that covers the upgrading of a Climax exact box to organic. As usual, we take care of the technicalities so that you can enjoy the music, but that's how it's done or done by your dealer. Uh, if you're interested in getting your Climax exact box upgraded, then please come speak to us and we'd be delighted to help. The other upgrade which is available is for Climax Exact 350 speakers and those are two DAC modules uh, or two DAC motherboards each with five DACs because the Climax 350 Exact speaker is a five-way speaker so we need five DACs per, per speaker so that's ten in total so you get two boards and they fit in the rear spines of the Climax Exact 350 speaker. So we've just received a set of uh, organic upgrades for a pair of Climax 350 Exact speakers. That's a much more involved upgrade. Uh, probably takes a few hours to complete rather than a few minutes that you've just seen here. Uh, but I'll just show you the motherboard so that you can see uh, what goes in the back of a Climax 350 speaker. Here you can see two boards. These will go in the back of uh, a pair of Climax 350 speakers. Again, these are specific to a particular set of speakers. Uh, so the serial numbers, etc., all lock into that model and the design and the room, etc., uh, and space optimization that you may have. Uh, but that is the organic upgrade for 350. As you can see, the exact and the organic logos on these, um, and they fit in the back of the speaker. Okay, thanks for watching. Hope you found that interesting. I welcome you to come and visit us at Ripcaster so that you can hear for yourself what organic can do in your system. Thanks for watching.